morning guys. 5 a.m. here in Dallas, Texas. It's Saturday, March 4th. I just landed. I compete at 12 o'clock, so I have about seven hours here. I'm gonna rent a car, take a little nap in that thing for a few hours, and then get ready to put in that work. Ah, let's go. It's 10 a.m. Just got like a four hour nap. I compete at 12. So I'm gonna go inside, check my weight, make sure everything's good. And it's time to go, baby, let's go. All right, guys, it's time. Here we go. This is the first match of the day. This is the semifinals, so it would be a two-match bracket. Going against this guy, Sergio Villas. I do not know who he is. We get to it. Standing up a little bit, feign a shot. He pulls straight to guard, pulls the Della Riva. And this guy goes straight for my foot. Gets low on my foot with the outside De La Riva hook and it's putting some major pressure on my foot. I just slept on a flight and slept in my car. I'm not tapping to this shit. I'm telling you right now. I defend. I free my left leg. I hook it out. And he ends up top and starts attacking my back. So in my head, I'm like, Dory, this is what you get for starting out slow. You always do this shit. Like, figure it out, bro. You got to come out hot from now on. He ends up like still attacking my back. He hips up and boom, he's still attacking my back. Now I get to a point where my I'm, I'm free of the choke. I'm going to start to look to recover half guard and get to my game. But now I'm battling from behind. I'm down 2-0 and two advantages. I get to my half guard. He's in the knee cut position. So with my right leg, I'm going to go shin to shin to bring his right leg down. And I'm going to hip out and push his knee down to the mat. Now what I like to do from here is I like to grab my belt and trap his left arm post. I squeeze my knees together and point them to the right. This gets my wiggle wiggle sweep. And then I finish with like a modified butterfly where I kick his hips out to finish the sweep. He ends up in guard for a few minutes. It's kind of stagnant. I end up in a stack pass. I'm starting to put the pressure with my hips. I start to lift his butt. He goes to turtle but he does a good job at recovering guard. So I'm getting, I'm conquering the half here. I'm getting back to my guard passing. I have a weave pass here with my left hand. I'm gripping his bottom leg. I get my left leg out. And as he's kind of belly down, I'm looking to put the pressure. I need my head on his chest, not over his back. That's why he got me off balance here. And I did all that for nothing because look, I'm back to square run one in his guard again. So he puts me in 50-50. I pass my right leg to the outside. And I'm trying to bring my right knee to the mat so he can't underhook it in X guard. And I'm trying to put all my pressure to the right. At this point in the match, I believe I'm down by one advantage. And there's about a minute left. So I have an underhook and a cross face here. I'm trying to stay chest to chest. So I keep moving my body pressure lower. And I try to get lower and get tighter with my arms. So it's a lot of pressure on the cross face. And it's going to be hard for him to hold my leg my right leg so i'm trying to sprawl my right leg out i finally open up his legs and get my right leg out and i end up going to the left to pass the guard there's about 30 seconds left here and i secure the pass to win the match now i'm just you know trying to run out the time i answer neon belly and boom time's out respect to my opponent we had a solid match i get my hand raised and now we're moving on to the finals here. Thank you, ref. And here we go. So now, finals match. I fought this guy at the World Semifinals at Purple Belt in 2021. This guy's a scrapper. We had a great match. So now I'm excited to run it back. I got the best of him last time, but we had a really good match. I take a shot. He sprawls really well. We lock horns for a little bit of time, so I fast forward here. We fast forward to where he pulls guard. He pulls single leg X. He gets a nice guard pull. I try to pull that hand so he can't underhook my leg. I open up my right knee, and I'm looking to pass here. We end up standing. He hits me with the Uchimata. I try to roll him through, but he ends up on top, so I can't stay down. If I stay down, I get two points. He gets two points. So what I do is I kick out and reset standing. When I reset standing, there's no points for him. All he got was an advantage. So now I'm down one advantage. I pull to my half guard and I go for the same sweep that I hit in the first match. It works again. 
that's actually my specialty. I get, I call it the wiggle wiggle. <laughs> and now I look to conquer the over under pass. So look, I'm trying to straddle his right leg and attack the knee bar. When I attack the knee bar, he turns away to relieve some pressure on his knee, which gives me a super easy pass. That's one of my favorite passes to do and the, one of my favorite ways to set it up. So I attack the knee bar, I get my pass, and now I'm holding the side control, staying heavy. I end up on the other side. He turns away. I try to take his back, but then he does a good job at recovering, and I end up back on top looking to pass the guard. I find another opportunity here to enter my over-under pass. He has spider with the left leg. I get over that spider, uh, spider grip. I look to get into the folding pass. Once he brings his hips out to defend the folding pass, I set up the over-under. And look where we are. I'm attacking that knee bar again. And now I'm trying to find it. I know it's. I know he can't turn away anymore because I'm hugging his right, his right hip pretty well. And now I'm just gonna look to find the right angle on that knee. So I'm hipping down into the knee, hipping down into the knee over and over and over, trying to find it. And there's about three minutes left in this match, and I'm just trying to stay on this knee bar because he cannot move. I'm up five zero right now, so I'm kind of playing strategic here a little bit. But I'm in a submission, and most people I can submit with this knee bar. But this guy has super flexible knees. I stay on it for about 30 seconds. And then here he tries to recover like X guard and half guard or in 50-50 guard. He tries to pull my left leg in. And I do a good job at getting my left leg back. Once I get my left leg back, I look to set up the over under pass. Boom, nice and easy. I'm telling you, if you like the over under pass, set up the knee bar first. They'll give you the pass. It's like a gift to you. I get the side control pass. There's about 30 seconds left here, so I'm just gonna stay heavy. I try to look for a submission, but it's, it's kind of hard at this point. I have Neon Belly here, he turtles. There's about five seconds left in the match. And that's it, folks. We get the win. We win heavyweight gold at the IBJJF Dallas Open. Thank you, Kaiser, for coaching me. Thank you, Lily, for supporting and watching the matches. Thank you, God, for protecting me and my opponent and allowing us to give our best effort. Help the opponent up. Great match. Respect to you. Thank you, ref. We get our hand raised. I'm super hyped after, after the journey of getting the flight canceled and having to book the morning of. It was a mess, but hey, we made it happen and overcame adversity. So I got better from that. It's all good now. Respect the other opponent's coach, shake everybody's hand, and we get the win. Here's the podium. So the guys that lost in the semifinals decided not to go to the podium. Sometimes they don't want to be in the picture of them losing, but, man, that's so disrespectful. Own up to your loss and go to the damn podium. Let's go. Heavyweight champ. Two matches, won both by points. The first match was five to two and the second match was eight to zero thanks for watching the video guys if you're still here i do have sweaters on my website at imdown.com you can also follow me on instagram at i'm down thanks for watching if you enjoyed the video please like and subscribe i have more videos and more match breakdowns a lot of content coming soon okay thanks for watching guys